Okay, Saad, bro, if I have jujitsu black belt and I'm not good at wrestling, uh, I will lose in MMA? Well, not necessarily, man. It depends. It depends. Like you can, uh, you know, like if you if you jump on a guy's leg and manage to take it to the ground and then work your magic, like it, it could be good. But I mean, you have to have other skill sets too, right? Because you got to remember, like MMA is mixed martial arts. So now it's not like UFC 1. In UFC 1, like it was like, one style versus one style like jujitsu guy karate guy karate guy versus kung fu guy so you know like they all were they all uh had limited skill sets that came from their um their style so like you know it was kind of like the i would say the man the, the best man with the best technology wins kind of and at that time like bjj was the best technology so it's good that you have uh like a BJJ black belt, mm, but have you been trained? Like, but what about everything else, right? You know, like Damian Maya did that too, right? He he's a high level BJJ guy, and then he came into the UFC, and he, and he was just choking everyone out, choking everyone out. And his philosophy was, okay, I'm just going to show everyone that I could just beat the crap, like choke everybody out. BJJ, that's it. So he didn't, fo and and that worked for a while until people figured out, like, okay. Now I just got to defend myself and I'm just going to, people are like, okay, I just got to be careful of this, be careful of that. And then, then he started losing and then he realized he needed to add into his game. So he wanted to become a, so he had to add like boxing and kickboxing and all that. And then he, for a little period, he was like trying to strike more than he was actually trying to grapple. And then that then it worked and then it didn't work. And then after that, he went back to his roots of like BJJ, but he was mixing it up a little bit better. But yeah, you, you know, you, you see what I mean, right? So like, it's good, the BJJ black belt. Of course, it has to be adapted to MMA, right? Because a lot of things that you do in sports jiu-jitsu is just like, it doesn't work. It's it's pure garbage for, for MMA. So um, yeah, you, you have to train, like your, your jiu-jitsu has to be adapted to MMA. And well, listen, if you can't take it to the ground, but with takedowns, like, yeah, that's gonna, you know, that's gonna... It's not going to serve you very much.